Hello friends, today we are back with another video game. Today is gonna be a visual novel. It's one of my favorite genres to play in and the visual novel we're trying out is called Hatafo Boyfriend. Hato is a Japanese word that I believe means either pigeon or bird. So that is why on the screen we see lots of cute, not really, but lots of birds. I do have to leave a very quick disclaimer. I am not a fan of pigeons and birds. They actually scare the crap out of me. The most interaction I've had with pigeons is running away from them when they come near me on the street or in parks. Like, I am just so terrified of them. But we are going into this visual novel with an open heart and an open mind. We will try our best to maybe get a pigeon boyfriend or a bird boyfriend and see if we can find love. Let's head right into it and start a new game. St. Pigeon Nations Institute. Welcome to St. Pigeon Nations. Please enter your name. Hyoko. Hyoko is a very pretty sounding name, but I'm going for some like a fantasy idea, a name that I don't have that I wish I had, or like a good, uh, good fantasy name. Hmm. Let's be, uh, Gir Girardelli is coming into my head, like the chocolate. Okay, we can only be Girardelle. Um, that sounds a little like India to me, like a city in India. So, uh, maybe we'll go for something else. Okay, Samosa, that's what we'll do. We'll be Samosa. Enter your last name. Tosaka sounds nice, but we're gonna continue our food theme. Samosa curry. Oh my god, am I? Oh god, I hope this is not entering a category where people think I'm racist. I just genuinely like samosas and curries, guys. Okay, we are going to make my last name. Uh, To entice the other bird fellas, I will be worms that should that should uh make them like me right i sound like tasty food to them they'll want to just eat me up samosa worms is that okay yes absolutely i'm actually getting excited for this game how to full boyfriend includes a powerful visualization module allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced display human portraits Absolutely. I think I prefer that, actually. I might get less creeped out. Configurations saved. Now let's head right into it. The 8th of April, St. Peggio Nations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say, this school is known for one thing in particular. Dun 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 dun. This school is Japan's. Nope the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. It's like Harry Potter, I guess, or like Hogwarts, um, but except for birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports all come to St. Pidgeot Nations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I am often asked why I chose to come here despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Girl, I wonder why. Question mark, question mark. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. There we go. Our worst fears came true. This is the most typical looking pigeon that I usually run from. Samocha's chan says, Ryota, usually you'll have been ready for an hour, hour by now, Samosa. You got me stuttering now, Ryota. You're, you're creeping me out. Overslept. Ryota Kawara. This rock dove is named Kawara Ryota. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. Whoa, how were we friends for so long? Did we maybe like take care of him when he was just an egg and I was a human? I guess birds in this world could talk. He looks like a cute and friendly, kind looking face. He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Oh, I guess we like 
uh, meaty, proteiny food. Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. I hope it's not worms. I hope he's not gonna find me like insects. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Rialta. Oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers, no good being late on the first day. And so Ryota pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun. Nice, let's see our, oh, look at that, wow. First term, the most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. I think we're in 2-3. Rialta and I are in the same class again. Oh, nice. Old faces, new faces, a strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Oh, the teacher's here. Ooh, I didn't know pigeons could be white. Good morning, everybody. Kazuwaki. Er, I'm Nanaki Kazuwaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. You seem so. I specialize in math and physics and also some other things. Z Z. Sir, wake up. It's homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open? Oh, look at that gentle face. Ah, this quill. Not a pigeon. This quill is Nanaki Kazuaki. He's a famously soporific math professor. I don't know what soporific means, but I'm going to assume it means like smart or like good at math. I heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Maybe that's a sleepy face, but he looks kind. Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show, great minds comes in all forms. That's right, never judge a book by its cover. Ah, I'm sorry, isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please introduce yourself, Shirogane. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think that I'm here because I wish to be. Ooh, what kind of bird is that? Oh, well, I guess uh, that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into kuluks, kuluks, and dissenters. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least state your name, Shirogane? Mm. Shirogane Label Sakuya. Ooh. Ooh, look at this cocky and confident gaze. It seems this fantail is Shirogane Sakuya. His feathers would make any broody proud. Look at that. That is a lot of feathers. I wonder what kind of bird this is. Kind of reminds me of like a white peacock. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Yeah, I hope so too. I will try hard. Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Lunch already? Today is slipping by so quickly. That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly any birdie here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not? A mourning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. This is spelled mourning, like not like good morning, but like in mourning. I wonder if this is an actual type of bird. Mourning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. I do live in America, but I've never seen this. He actually looks a little bit like a seagull to me. Um, did you want something from me? 
he looked away. Not really. Ooh, the music suddenly got very low and kind of sad. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes, I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk as if to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? Ugh. He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood? I'm Worm Samosa, a sophomore. What about you? Ugh. You are... Ugh. Nagiki. Fujishiro. Nagiki. Freshman. Ooh, it's a younger broody. Oh, he's sad. His hairstyle is kind of, um, very... It's a little bit feminine. Kind of cool. I like the green hair, but he looks so sad. Fujishiro Nagiki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. I guess we're in Japan. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. The music's also sad. That makes me want to cheer him up. Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I will be back for you. I keep meeting depressing people today. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait a minute, isn't that? You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakia. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother? After all these years? My brother? You must be joking. You've never been once a brother to me. Please, don't talk to me again. I've no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Is he a half-breed because he doesn't have like a magnificent back feather? He looks like an older brother though because he's taller. Hey, wait, just up. <sighs> I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man, Sakazaki Yuya, is Sakuya's brother? <gasps> this guy is a ladies' man. He's a, um, bird man too, I guess. Bird la lady birds man? Bird ladies man? I wonder what the story behind that is. Hey. <gasps> you heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? I, 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 I'm sorry. I didn't mean to listen in on you. Haha, <gasps> <laughs> no sweat. I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all of you little ladies. <sighs> but that there wasn't so cool. Oh, look at this confident, um, sexy look. Hair standing up too. This fantail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upper-class man. Upper-classman, I mean. Fantail? Hmm, I don't see the tail. But I guess he's a pigeon type too. I've never seen a white pigeon in my life. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous or infamous throughout the school. Every birdie knows of him. You're Samosa, right? Wait, how did you? I know every birdie here. Besides, you're the only human. A single poppy in a field of rye. Wow, he makes me sound like a diamond in the rough or like a gem in a pile of like poop. That sounds good. I feel flattered. Did you say you were a friend of Sakuya's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class, that's all. I'd never have thought that stuck up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. Aristocrat wannabe. Hmm. He is an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article in the flesh. Does that mean he is? He's a bit of a pain, so good luck. Mon ami, adui adu. He really is a noble bird. I've never heard anything like that about you yet, though. Probably a twisty business. I really like that sound. It's kind of calming. I don't hear that bell in American schools. I've never heard it. 
That's all for today. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! Huh? Sir, where's Ryota? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there? No, my friend. Now that I think about it, Ryota always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. I will. Um, excuse me? No birdies here? There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence. There's no birdie here. Ryota? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Huh, weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryota, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. Ethyl per, trifi, lucio benzine, what do these even do? Care to find out? Dun 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 dun. <gasps> oh my god, he looks the most fierce of them all. Like, ooh, those eyes. Oh my god, and the beak. Ooh, he's, he's the most creepy one. D -d 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 Doctor? I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. Mm? Uh, no thank you. Look at that sly devil looking face. This partridge is Iwamani Shu, the school doctor. Partridge, I've never heard of that. He's rather creepy in person and has a bad reputation among the student body. I thought this was supposed to be a sexy look, but I guess it's supposed to be a creepy look. Every birdie knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with aspergillus, pestilacolitis, or even worse things. And I never even heard him once come in the door. Ninja doctor? You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Mm, I heard that Ryota Kawarawa from 2-3 was supposed to be here. Him? He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come find me before going home? Yeah, why didn't he? I assume we maybe like go home together. Uh, s s sorry to bother you. I'll be going now. Ah, finally out of that den of evil. Ryota's already gone home. What do I do now? Do I get to choose? Oh, I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, bird watching. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in middle school, and it's always funny watching the birds hop around. That does sound funny. Like, lots of birds running down a track. I think their club room is on the ground floor off to the side. A white dove is having a tantrum outside. Sun. Cuckoo! This is no pudding for a man. Cuckoo! Okozan rejects it. It is a lie. A vicious falsification. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. Ooh. He he looks the funniest out of all the birds I've seen so far. I guess they look pretty similar. He looks kind of like a fantail too, like the other kind of birds. This is Oko-san. He doesn't really look like it, but supposedly he's a fantail pigeon. I think? Either way, he's hyper. I guess he has no human portrait too. Cool. Okosan has dis has suffered a deception most vile, a wretched betrayal. Betrayal? Cool. Okosan instructed that pudding be provided for new members. Cool. But this is no pudding. Ousted, scorned, betrayed, dragged into the street, and shot by those he trusted most. It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looked like normal store bought pudding. I like this guy already. He's kind of funny. What's wrong with it? Cuckoo! Spare the chest, young lady. Okasang used wing attack. It's super effective. Cool. The rue de day they cross Okasang. He'll have them flayed, hanged, shot at dawn. He will. Cool. Okasang must now train to achieve true pudding. Farewell. And he's gone. He's a good runner, but what does pudding have to do with the track team? I like pudding. And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pidgeot Nations. 
Ooh, that was a good first day. The 11th of April. Err, uh, I think we want to choose the class council today. As you all know, this school doesn't require you to join any club. If you want to, you can. But if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. Wow. Cool. Oko-san has time only for the track team. Is he maybe like the head of the track team or a student? That's good. What about you, Shirogane? Hey, foolish question. I already hold a position here. Oh, that's right. You became school student president when you're admitted. Nepotism. Huh. Don't we get to vote? Just coming to school is enough for me. Oh, Ryota, I'm glad you're okay. You had to take care of your mother on your own and all. Huh. He's a good boy or good birdie. Hmm, I wonder what I should do. Join the... Here is our first choice. We can join the student council with the aristocrat snobby guy. Or track team with pudding coo guy. Or library staff with a ninja... Ninja, ninja, oh wait, that's not Ninja Doctor. That's the sad boy. I want to go to the library. I want to cheer him up. That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun. Dun, 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 dun. The 12th of April. I have now one wisdom, 800 vitality, and five cha, probably charisma. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Attend. I'm awful at math in person. Um, gym, I'm also very bad at. Music? Uh, I've been told that I have like no tone and my voice fluctuates all the time when I'm singing. But I still love music. Let's hear some bird music or go to the gym or math. Let's go to the gym. Let's do some birdie exercises. I had to sit out the wing training, but it was fun anyway. Maybe someday I'll be able to fly too. Samosa leveled up. Vitality increased by 5. Ooh. Very nice. I'm on receptionist duty today. Better hurry. Boring, as usual. The library here doesn't seem very popular. Not enough books? The bookshelf doesn't seem that big. If this is for the whole school, it's actually very little. It's on the 5th floor though, so at least the view is nice. Sitting here twiddling my thrum thumbs is bad for me. I wish someone would come ask me something. Huh, huh. There's no birdie here. I wonder if it would be okay to close early? Ah, I wish I could just spread my wings and fly away. Planning to jump off the building? The window there is rather good for that, Miss Receptionist. <gasps> Nagaki, when, when did you? I've been here all along. I never notice. He's almost as bad as the doctor. You're thinking I have no presence, right? It's okay. I already know that. That's so sad. You certainly seem to like this place. Yes. Is that a problem? Um. You should go outside. No, books are nice. If I tell him to go outside, he'll think that I'm trying to kick him out. I'm going to say no books are nice because books are nice. Click. Click, click. Let me, let me. Click it. There we go. They are. Why don't you join the library staff, Nagiki? You could read whatever you want. I already read whatever I want. Touché? You shouldn't slack off, Miss Receptionist. And with that, he takes a book and is gone between the stacks. What a strange bird. Actually, he might be the most beautiful looking bird so far. Ah, sitting at home is so relaxing. Wait, if this is my home, I kind of look homeless. Like, this is like rocks on a beach and that looks like the ocean. I feel like I'm homeless and sleeping. Oh no, am I homeless? Or am I just, like, sitting somewhere? Oh, tomorrow is the class hike. Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, hell first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. Udon is very tasty. I want some. Today is the hike. We stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? T 
talk to. My childhood friend Ryota, Sakuya san Kazuaki. Ryota, the childhood friend, Sakuya, I think, is the aristocrat. San is ku. Kazuaki is my teacher. I'm going to go for aristocrat. Let's melt his burning, touch, unco uh, 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 cold, untouched heart. Unacceptable. In a temper, as usual. Why? Why do I have to come to a place like this and on foot? It's a hike, Sakuya. You have to walk. For what purpose? As exercise? Foolishness! Exercise is for peasants. No, for fun. You're supposed to enjoy the change of scenery. Look over here. Don't we have a nice view? Sakuya looks like he still has something to say, but he reluctantly comes over to me. Ooh, he's a sundere. I think maybe he's acting angrier than he really is. Sheesh, what a kid. Dun -dun. The 6th of May. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Attend? We did gym class. Um, this is a music class. Let's hear some birdie music. Today is a music history lesson. So much thinking outside the box. Oh, I get you. I feel like I'm about to fly off the handle. Oh, but this is what Mozart is all about, I guess. I wonder what those wigs felt like. They look like they're wearing parchments on their head. Oh, these guys, maybe? Do you seek to mock the great master's low-born philistine? Diddy. Some also leveled up again. Charisma increased by 5. Awesome. The more charisma, the better. Maybe I'll be able to impress some more birdies. Er, I imagine you're all well aware, but... The sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Sports festival season already? If we're in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival, so it has always been in May. Mm, I love festivals. What are you going to do, Ryota? I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Some birdie has to. Three-legged race. I wonder... It's making me wonder, like, I've never looked at it close, nor am I going to Google it because I'll probably be too afraid to, but I wonder how many fingers a pigeon has. Huh. If anyone knows, please leave a comment in the comment section below. I'm actually a little bit curious. Like, how many fingers or, like, um, I don't know what else to call them. Legs that they have? Toes? Okay. Oh, maybe toes. That sounds more accurate. Cool. Oko-san will handle the marathon. Indeed he will. You do have a lot of stamina, Oko-san. What about you, Sakuya? You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? It is a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? How about being a cheerleader? I want to. I want to be a cheerleader. The general, in other words. Very well. Leave it to me. Um, I. I don't think that's. Also, the first A team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use help if any birdie still can't decide. That's all for today! Ryota's doing the three-legged race, Oko-san running the marathon, and Sakuya's a cheerleader. Yuya might be running the first A-10. I think Yuya's the doctor. Hmm. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. Ooh, today is a sports festival, huh? Alright, but I do think I am going to stop this video here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this game. I did actually enjoy it a lot more than I expected to. And I feel like my fear of looking at a pigeon photo has decreased dramatically. So, a little clap here and there. Yay! I... Hope you like this game enough to want to watch episode 2. If you did like it, please give it a nice little thumbs up so I know that you liked it. And if you did like it, I always appreciate a nice little comment, so please feel free to leave them. If you end up liking this game enough that you want to try it yourself, I would love to know as well. I release new gaming videos out every single week. 
two to three times a week. If you subscribe to me, you'll get notifications of when I post next. And remember, the only way that I know you like something is if you actually smack that like button. So be sure to do so. I will see you guys very, very soon. Bye.